At your first time in India, what's your initial reaction regarding the country and the people here? Yes, it's my first time that I'm in India. I really want to, to know this country. Uh, India is a country that has a, a rich culture and heritage of temples, churches and the nature is unbelievable. The people is friendly, uh, very close and hopeful and always uh, half a smile in their, in their face. So for that I'm, I'm very, very happy to stay here and, and comfortable. What are your targets for the upcoming season with Ubisha FC? Uh, my first goal is uh, give uh, everything to to Odisha, no? to to continue growing ISL, uh, work day by day to to give my best version and the club and our fans um, are uh, happy to for my my performance and finally I I want to earn the respect uh, in the field. What's your opinion on the other foreign signings of the club this season and how are you looking forward to playing together with them? Uh, I think uh, we have a good mix uh, of uh, foreigners players. Uh, first, uh, we have uh, Javi and, and Victor know the, the competitions and they were champions, so it's very important for us. Then later on, and who knows the Asian football, uh, he plays in one of the best teams in, Asia, in Malaysia. And he plays with national team too, uh, to, from Malaysia. Then we have uh, Aridai, that is a different player with a lot of quality and play uh, a lot of years in, in high level in, in Spain. And finally, I think with our striker uh, is the best. I think uh, he played in the most important leagues in, in Europe, in Italy, uh, Spain and Germany and scored goals in, in, in all the leagues. And I think uh, um, we, we can do a good team and I, I really want to, to join together. What's your take on the Indian boys at the club and what do you reckon about the Indian youngsters who form a crucial part among the players attending pre-season in Goa? Uh, well, and they surprised me. Uh, they, they have a lot of qualities and they are very young. So I think it's, it's good for, for, for us because um, they, they, they are angry to, to each um, big things in, in, in the football. And, and I think we, with our experience and the desire to, to do big things, uh, we, we can do a, a good team together. Tell us about your initial conversation with coach Kiko Ramirez and what do you think about his vision for the club ahead of this season? Yes, Kiko is a very close uh, coach. Uh, he called several times in, in this summer no? Yo, to explain me the project, uh, to explain me his, his, th his things about the, uh, the football. And finally, I, I decided to come here uh, to work with him, to work with, with Kino also, with Masca. And I think they have a good group uh, to work. And I'm sure that we will enjoy together and we have a, a, a good results in, in this season. You have a lot of experience playing at the top level in Europe and with against some quality players. How do you think your knowledge and experience will be helpful for the Indian players here at the club? I'm lucky to, to, to have played a lot of years in, in the first uh, division in Spain and in the second division. I play in, in Levante, Betis, uh, Cordoba, Elche, well, in a lot of teams from, from there. So I, I live um, good, good moments and bad moments and I think um, make it my, my experience. And, and from now I, I'm staying in India and I think uh, this experience I have to use to, to help my, my teammates, my young teammates and, and give everything to, to, to uh, uh, do the best in the in this season. Odisha FC have David Villa and the DV7 group on board in this project and have also partnered with Watford FC. How do you think these two will be beneficial for the development of players here? 
Uh, well, the, the support of, of David Villa Group and, and the Watford is very important for us. I think they, they know uh, about the football and they have a lot of experience in, in this sport. And I, I think uh, for the young, young players uh, from India, it's a very good opportunity you know, to, to, to grow up and maybe, uh, why not, uh, to play in Europe uh, the next years uh, in, in, for example, Watford. Is I think, and I decided I decided that uh, these these things will happen. The fans welcomed you with some very good messages after your signing. However, they will not be able to see you this season again. What will be your message to them? First, I want to to say thanks for for your warm welcome and um, for the situation from COVID situation. I. I can't or we can't uh, enjoy with them in the stadium but I'm sure that we have to give the best for the matches and I'm sure that we enjoy this year and we have a good results in the season. So come on Odisha, we are together. <laughs>